Hi, this is Jeremiah from Welcome to Fresburg, bringing you free TV to watch cartoons online with educational videos for students. Please take a moment to hit the thumbs up, like, and subscribe to our channel. Girls run the world. Okay, I was having a little fun there, but right now I want to talk to you about sisters who have changed the world and are flawless. With Thanksgiving upon us, what better way to talk about my sisters than to represent for a woman who was a Thanksgiving icon, Sarah Josepha Hale. Sarah Josepha Buell was born in Newport, New Hampshire on October 24, 1788. Many remember Sarah as a writer, promoter of women's education, and an editor claiming her fame as the author of the nursery rhyme, Mary Had a Little Lamb. Not only was she a talented author, but Sarah was also known for helping Thanksgiving as a recognized national holiday. Sarah was the first woman to be the editor of an American magazine for women in 1828, known as the 19th century's most successful ladies magazine. It was filled with original stories, only taking stories that she thought would help other women. Sarah used the magazine, Goldie's Ladies Book, to begin her goal of celebrating a day of thanks with the entire country. At that time, Thanksgiving was mainly celebrated in New England. There were other states that did celebrate it, but they were all celebrated on different dates. Sarah started her mission to recognize Thanksgiving in 1846. She did this by writing letters to five presidents over 17 years. The presidents included Zachary Taylor, Millard Fillmore, Franklin Pierce, James Buchanan, and Abraham Lincoln. Not having success for years, she continued her efforts by talking to congressmen, writing letters every year in her magazine, and even writing letters to governors at the time. Never giving up, she kept trying in her letters to Secretary of State William Stewart. Hale's idea ended up getting to Abraham Lincoln, and she finally got her wish. After reading her letter, Lincoln helped make Thanksgiving a national holiday in 1863. This celebration also came at a time where the Civil War had ended. The nation looked at the celebration of the holiday as a day of unity, helping to bring peace to the country after the Civil War had ended. Never giving up on her dream of seeing Thanksgiving celebrated as a national holiday, Sarah Josepha Hale stayed flawless while achieving her goal. Are you looking for cartoons online, to watch videos online, or free movies online? Then subscribe to our channel. Here we have funny videos for families, teachers with elementary school, middle school, or any K-12 students. We are a cartoon network that touches on bully topics, education, leadership, and more. Stay connected and subscribe now to Welcome to Fresburg.